Right, the Arrhenius equation it allows us to relate our rate constant K to the activation energy and temperature. If we're looking at two different temperatures, one and two, we can rewrite the Arrhenius equation relating these two conditions. And in this problem, we're going to be solving for the activation energy Ea. Okay, we solved the equation for Ea, and we just plug in the appropriate variables and chug the answer out. All right, and here we are at the answer. We put in the appropriate numbers. We have to use R in terms of joules. Uh, our K units are going to cancel out. I didn't bother writing them in. Uh, the units of 1 over temperature are 1 over K. So once we crunch this out, we know we have units of joules per mole. Uh, three sig figs are justified in our answer. So we can write this with three sig figs, divide by a thousand to get from joules to kilojoules, and we have our final answer.